away when his wrath is kindled but a little blessed are all they that put their trust in him right and we we put a hundred percent uh uh trust in yahweh bahashem yahweh shah right because that's all we got right there's no other way for us to uh receive salvation right and especially after he gave us this wisdom knowledge and understanding right It says in the scriptures, uh, to uh, to whom much is given, much is required. So what? Now we got this wisdom, knowledge, and understand what we're doing. We got to do more, right, to basically re repay that, you know, right? And it's going to be to our reward, right? This one right here. This is uh, Ecclesiastes uh, 7, uh, verse um, verse 12 It says for wisdom is a defense and money is a defense But the excellency of knowledge is that wisdom giveth life to them that have it, right? Us using this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, right? Is guiding us in the right way So we can receive a benefit for the work that we're doing now You know? But hey, a lot of people don't understand that A lot of people are not supposed to understand that, right? This is um, Isaiah 6, uh, uh, Isaiah 6 verse 9, it says, And he said, Go and tell this people, Hear ye indeed, but understand not, and see ye indeed, but perceive not. Hey, that's a heavy scripture right there, right? It says, Hear ye indeed, but understand not. And see ye indeed, but perceive not. They think that we're just hating on Christianity because they got a white Jesus and stuff like that. They don't understand the facts of the matter, right? That they've been lied to, not just about his appearance, but what's written in the scriptures, right? The real order that's going on, right? They, they've been uh, 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 misinformed, right? Now that the prophets are on the streets, right? We're giving you the truth according to scriptures, Right? Because you think the white man wrote the Bible. You think that um, that's a crazy fantasy, fantasy tale. Right? You, you think that uh, uh, that it's, it's been rewritten and uh, 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 mixed up and all this stuff. Right? So so your your belief, right, is uh, 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 has stumbling blocks in front of it. Right? That's going to take you away from the real knowledge and understanding that's here that is for your salvation you know right but we, we can't do nothing about that right we can't we can't make you believe it says in the scriptures that uh um uh, uh, so let's actually get it Romans 3 right Romans 3 verse 3 it says for what if some did not believe right it says for what if some did uh, did not believe shall their unbelief make the faith of the most high without effect so is is the uh, uh, is the uh, is the is the uh, is the prophecies affected? It's a lot here. It's a it's the prophecies affected because you don't believe in these scriptures, right? You don't believe in these words, 
right? Or you only believe in half these words or whatever it is, right? Or, or you just you just think this is written by man or whatever, right? And it's funny because they they will go more for believing a Simps, uh, a Simpson a Simpsons episode, right? Than uh, believing believing in the scriptures when the scriptures got everything a hundred percent accurate, you know. They, they, there is no uh, uh, contradiction, and if there, if you see a contradiction, there's something that you don't understand because the most uh, um, uh, uh, doesn't contradict himself, you know. It says uh, uh, Romans three, Romans three, verse uh, three. It says, "For what if some did not believe?" Shall their unbelief make the faith of Yahweh without effect? Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh shall forbid. Yet let God be true, but every man a liar, as it is written, that thou mayest be justified in thy sayings, and mightest overcome when thou art judged. Right? So us, we're bringing out this truth, whether you like it or not. Whether you believe in it or not. Right? Whether whether you uh, 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 agree with the words or not. You know? Because, hey, you don't... Hey, you don't have to agree, right? You you got to get down with Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah's program, right? It says, um, Isaiah, Isaiah 6 verse 9, and he said, go and tell this people, hear ye indeed, but understand not. Hey, there's, there's people, there's, there's hundreds, there's thousands of people that walk by uh, Israelite camps, right, on a, a weekly basis, right? And they're never able to understand what's going on, right? And they never will be because what? The Most High, Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shah, Yahweh the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Shah, the Son, right? Uh, have a, has a stumbling block in, in front of them, you know? So they will not understand, so they will not be healed, so they will not come back to the uh, wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shah to be saved, right? There's people on this earth. Right, that they want to get this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, but they can't. Right, they want to receive salvation. They want to please Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah. They want to please the Heavenly Father, but they can't because whatever they did in their past life, right, or whatever uh, judgment that Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah has already set for them, right. Because a lot of people think that there's a uh, free will. There's not free will according to the scriptures, right? How is there free will? But there's uh, 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 prophecies that can't be broken, right? If there was free will, you would be able to break the prophecies, right? But but you can't. Why? Because everything is programmed to Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah's movement, right? It says, make the make the heart, which is talking about the mind of this people, fat, and make their ears heavy, and shut their eyes lest they see with their eyes and hear with their ears and understand with their heart and convert and be healed, right? Because hey, even even us pushing this word right now, it just sounds like a whole a whole bunch of mumble to um, these regular people, you know? Or they uh, 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 they, dis they, they disconnect from it, you know? Uh, easy disconnection from it, you know? Because of what uh, Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah has put in front of their eyes, right? But there's a, a, a certain uh, uh, a number. or your uh, imagination, or your opinion, right? Then you're blessed, right? You're truly blessed, right?
This is uh, Revelation 3, verse 18. It says, I counsel thee to buy of me gold trod in the fire, that, that thou mayest be rich and white raiment, that thou mayest be clothed, and that the shame of thy nakedness do not appear, and anoint thy eyes with eye salve, that thou mayest see, right? Not everybody's gonna get that eye salve, right, to understand this word, right? And you need to get that eye salve, right, uh, uh, to understand this word, to receive salvation, you know? Because if you don't, if you don't have to understand it, how do you expect to receive salvation, right? And then it, it poses the question, what, what were you doing in the church for 40 years? Or, or 20 years, or 10 years, or five years, right? What were you doing, right? You was blind. It says in the scriptures, the, dece uh, the, the, the deceived and the deceiver are his, right? Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shah made you deceive, right? He had us deceive before we came in the truth, right? Now that we have this truth, we hold fast onto it, right? that again it says revelation 3 verse 18 it says i counsel thee to buy of me gold tried in the fire right so what it's going to be those that can pers uh, 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 keep keep going and keep uh, uh, dealing with the persecution at hand right it says that thou mayest be rich in white raiment right pure and thou mayest be clothed with the wisdom knowledge and understanding and that the shame of thy nakedness do not appear, right? And anoint thine eyes with eye salve that thou mayest see. As many as I love, I rebuke and chasten. Be zealous therefore and repent, right? That's what we're, we're we got to be zealous, right? We, we, we push this word. We go on the highways and byways. We, we, we do the things pleasing unto you how by Shema Shah, no matter uh, uh, in season, out of season, right? No matter what's going on in our uh, daily life, right? Even though we can get head, uh, uh, we get uh, 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 roadblocks, you know, in our life, right? We still come back to pushing Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh We We stay on that goal, right? Right, we keep doing this work, you know? And this, this is a true statement, right? Because what? They're gonna remember that a prophet have been among them when these things come on the earth, right? The same way we've been pushing these things for years. And now that these things are happening in the earth, it's, it's gonna show that it's not just a coincidence that everything that we're saying is lining up. That's when the heavy persecution is really gonna come upon us, right? It says, Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man hear my voice, and that's talking about the men of the nation of Israel. It's not for all men. It's only for the men of uh, uh, Negro, Latino, and Native American descent, right? It's not, it's not for everybody, right? Because this book wasn't written for everybody, right? It says, um, Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man hear my voice and open the door, I will come into him and will sup with him and he with me. To him that overcometh will I uh, grant to sit with me in my throne, even as I also overcame and am set down with my father in his throne. He that have an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. Right? And what? Even even in our death, we, we will still receive that, uh, 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 that same reward. Right? And even Yahweh, Yahweh Shah showed us by actually going through the worst persecution, you know, by being put uh, 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 on that tree, you know, you know, right? So, so now, so now we're just we're just playing our part in the earth, you know, right? We're we're just standing in our lot, right? Get that now let me get this real quick too this is um this is uh titus two and one it says but speak thou the things which become sound doctrine right these things that we're saying are sound these things that 
we're uh, 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 pushing right the vibration that we're pushing up is pure because it's the spirit and power Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah. It says that the aged men be sober, brave, temperate, sound, and faith, and charity, and patience. Right? It says um, the aged woman likewise that they be in behavior as become holiness, not false accusers, not given to much wine, teachers of good things, right? This is a playbook of how to act in these last days, right? And if you're not uh, going according to uh, 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 this way, right? If you're not acting the way that Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah wants you to act, you're gonna be taken out. You're gonna be uh, destroyed, right? And the main thing about about these people, the main thing about these people in the world right now is that they don't have no faith. They don't have no belief, right? And they can't discern the times, you know? Right? And, and, and what? We're out here still pushing it, but there's going to be a time when we're not going to be here. We're not going to be pushing this truth no more, right? Because you already see what's going on in the earth. We're not going to be on the streets that long, you know? Because what? We're coming in the times of uh, uh, um, of uh, uh, the sword, famine, death, and destruction, as it says in Second Ezra, right? But hey, pe hey, people, people want to take us as a joke. People don't want to uh, uh, take heed onto this word. And the ones that are taking heed, the ones that are doing this work, you know, the ones that are, you know, uh, 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 fellowshipping with brothers and uh, uh, pushing this word and building up the uh, uh, knowledge right and edifying right and being examples they're the ones that's going to receive salvation you know and lord willing hey that we're a part of this number right lord willing i'm part of this number uh a part of that number right for doing the will of yahweh bahashim yahweh shah right and what the rest of the world sees that as a problem the rest of the world sees that as a threat the rest of the world sees 